previously on Scotty's Animals. <gasps> you know I'm here. No shame. Oh, now you're mad at me. You're mad at me. Hey. Excuse me. Come on. Come on. Don't shatter your teeth. Oh. What's the commotion? Gus! Gus! You're not supposed to be in here. It's okay, Gizmo. Oh, Gary, I'm sorry. Gus. All right, we got to do something about this once and for all. And it's going to require some engineering. Nope, you're in trouble. Well, I got some of these extra grids laying around and let's see if we can construct something that at least will keep Gus from hopping from one side of the balcony to the other. All right, let's do it. I think I got a good idea on how to do this. People always want to know, how do you bend these? Because they see some of my cage designs and I've got the bent grids. It's really easy. Feet on it, pick, figure out where you want to bend it, and you just bend it. Bend it. Just bend it. There you go. So, I'm thinking if I can cover Gus's side, I don't have to worry about these other guys hopping over. So this two grids should do it. And then, and I'm gonna zip tie this down. And then I take that bent grid that I just bent, and what if I just do it like this? So you see what we've got? Now it's sticking up. If I wanted to like cut it down to size, that'd be okay. But then I can just zip tie these together. And then there won't be any way that he can jump over here or over there. And I hate to have to do it to Gus. Gus. Gus, I hate to have to do it to you. Put you in the cage. But for now, I'm going to be volunteering at the rescue all day. And I don't want him hopping over while I'm gone. And you contrast that with Pippi. And even though, you know, you see he likes to lean over, especially when he knows I'm here. But he never hops out because he doesn't need to. He doesn't want to. He loves his, his grids. He loves his tunnel. He can visit all the people that he wants to visit. And he doesn't jump out. And this has only been like this for years if he wants to jump out he easily could but he doesn't because he's got everything he needs and everything he wants and most piggies are not escape artists but Gus is a special piggy yeah that's the word right Nate he's special now I like the little zip ties these ones came from the 99 cent store and they work pretty well so I'm just gonna tie them and I'm not gonna get all fancy I'm not gonna trim them I don't care what colors this is really just to see if I can keep him in <sighs> okay so I've zip tied this front piece to the divider here and to the lid and I've zip tied the top to the divider of the this centerpiece and then I zip tied everything to the back and then I zip tied it down here also so that he can't push through so basically from this side he can't get over in theory and he may have already done this before he can hop up from there climb over here and over to here and I wouldn't put it past him are you going to do that? 
We'll just see how determined he is. Do you promise to be good? Stay in your cage? Not harass these boys? Hmm? Gizmo and Gary, they don't want to be bothered by you. They don't want you annoying them. Okay? Alright guys, well, we're just going to hope that this boy stays where he's supposed to be and that he behaves himself and time will tell. Will I have to make more modifications to the cage? I don't know. When he was in the other cage, the modifications I made finally kept him in, so maybe I can keep him in again. Alright, until next time, thanks for watching. Be nice. Be good. Okay. 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 You ready to go home? Okay. 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 Okay.